Jazakallah. Thank you for your patient listening. Now we would have the question and answer session. Before we start the session, may I mention, on behalf of the organizing committee of this program, I would like to thank Mr. Himan Shurai, the Deputy Commissioner of Police Zone 1, and the Senior Inspector, Mr. Temkar, in charge of the Azad Maidan Police Station, for being courteous and kind enough to understand that this is an organized and disciplined program and allowing us in the last moment to have questions and answers on the mics as well as on the slips. We would continue on with the decency and decorum maintained till now in the program. To analyze the similarities between Hinduism and Islam adequately for all those present here today, in the limited time that we have available now, we would like the following rules to be followed during the question and answer session. Three mics have been provided in the ground, two next to the stage for the gents, one on my right and one on my left and one mic has been provided for the ladies in the center aisle in the front section of the ladies. The fourth question would be allowed from the slips. Please stand in the queue in front of the mics if you wish to put forward a question to the speaker and speak in the mic only when the mic handling assistant hand you the mic. Your question should be on the topic similarities between Hinduism and Islam only. Questions not relevant to the topic including any general questions on religion will not be permitted. Kindly state your question briefly and to the point. Only one question at a time per questioner will be allowed. For your second question, you would have to queue up at the back of the row and await your second chance, which seeing the time limitations, I'm doubtful you may get. We will allow one question at a time on each of the mics in clockwise rotation. The first question from the ladies' mic, the second question from the brothers who queue up on my right, and the third question from the microphone on my left down here. The fourth question would be from the slip, and we again rotate in serial order in similar fashion. Written question on slip papers which are available from the volunteers in the aisles and in the gangways can be sent up through the seating volunteers up to the stage on my left and the stage management director would hand over the same to me. In the interest of avoiding wasting time on irrelevant issues and to ensure a more educative and interesting question and answer session, my decision to allow or disallow questions which are irrelevant will be final. In this, I would also be assisted by the director of stage management and one of the officials from the police who have been deputed by DCP, Mr. Heman Shurai. Kindly state your name and profession before putting forward your question so that the speaker can give you an adequate level response. Can we have the first question from the sisters?